we have been sharing on the word of confused and god brings confusion in our life for a purpose many times we used to think that confusion is something where we we end up our life no do not end up your life because there is a confusion in your life because god wants to play a wonderful role in your life and when i was sharing last sunday at the hindi church when i was last sharing at the hindi church we we visit a hindi church in kurtorim every sunday evening and now we have come up with a wonderful tent there is a testimony by rocky who is going to share in 5 10 minutes or 5 minutes whatever ellen is going to share his testimony about 20 to 30 minutes so all together we have how many minutes now okay okay so this is the wonderful testimony of ellen and and rocky will share how god has helped him to build a tent and ellen is going to share how god confused in his life how god confused in his life to no jesus can we give a clap for alan you must have not decided aja by the way we are also having a breaking of bread today we will be doing a breaking of bread also please don't go away because breaking of bread we do it once a while so that you can be part taking in lords in lords in lords ha when you come for breaking of bread you are actually saying god is saying hey you are having meal with me and if you want to dine with god the one who has saved your life then you please wait till the end amen praise god over to alan good morning church for those who don't know me my name is alan fernandez and i'm married to one wife <laughs> this lady in pink okay she is my wife and two lovely kids i have shane the one was singing with you thanks thanks there thanks there and my small baby here shaina okay i i never in my wildest dreams ever thought that i would stand on the pulpit and 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 share about my my testimony or speak about jesus in public because i come from a musical background and i always thought that i will be a big superstar and i would you know speak some day about how good i am you know i would speak how good i am but today i'm here not to speak how good i am i'm here to speak how good our god is amen amen so i like to begin with my story my journey of how i found jesus uh i come from a rich family and um we had come from germany down so my dad had uh, brought a mercedes car then we had a you know caravan what is a caravan a caravan is a van where you have the kitchen bed and everything in that and that is attached hook to your car and you pull it okay so it's a moving house as you can say and we had a truck so we had come all the way from germany and as you know that when you bring anything from an outside country we have to pay customs to the country that you are going to reside so my daddy had to pay customs for bringing the car and all those things but my daddy didn't pay so he thought you know he will escape and he didn't pay but once one fine day the customs came and they they took away everything and my father was running up and down delhi goa ministers and trying all his possible ways to get back the thing the cars but uh, it was not possible and in this process he lost most of his money and he lost his health also and in this process all the big friends you know all the ministers rane and all they used to come to our house once a month for partying and all that even they stopped coming because when you come down in society the society leaves you amen. amen so my father was struggling he got into a depression mode you know so i at a very young age i was 14 and just when my father and mother they were celebrating their silver jubilee uh i thought like what i could do since i was not earning money my sister paid for the party i said what i can do so since i was just learning music 
we formed a band in the school. And I thought, like, we'll do around four or five songs. We play for the party. So we brought the drums in the bus. You can imagine, no? The drums in the bus. Speaker we brought holding from the market. And without my dad's knowledge, we placed everything inside. And we gave him a surprise. And my dad was very surprised to see me because he had put me actually for guitar classes. But I was playing drums that day. <laughs> I never learned drums, but I happened to play drums. And drumming and singing. Musicians will know that to drum and sing is very difficult. But I, without even knowing to play that instrument, I was playing that instrument and I was singing on top. And uh, Anthony will know the song La Bamba. Those songs we had done during that day. And that day the GM of uh, Fort Aguada also had come, Mr. Monteiro. So he told my father, this guy is very talented, your son. One day he'll come up. But my dad never wanted me to pursue music. He used to tell me like, uh, you know, you can lose a talent, but education will never go away from you. So he was always trying to encourage me to get myself educated, highly educated. He wanted me to be an engineer, but I had other plans. <laughs> so one fine day after the 12th, I told my dad, I don't want to study any longer. I want to pursue my career in music. So I started pursuing my career in music. Meanwhile, our financial uh, status was not improving. But as I got into the band, I, I joined a band, commercial band. Then I started earning. Then I started giving money at home, helping my parents. And slowly, slowly, the situation started getting better. As I progressed in my musical career, I became famous very fast. OK? And um, I was the lead guitarist at that time. And I had long hair till here. And uh, you know, a rock star, you know, the tie, the hair, bandana, and all that. So I did all those things during those days. And um, we became very famous. Our band became famous. And I started growing. As I started growing, I joined the band Big City Band. I think you must be knowing about the band. And that time, they were the topmost band. So I joined them. I was the main singer in the band. So as we started performing, performing, everyone started, you know how people encourage you, like, no, wow, what are you saying here? What are you, you're awesome here. So, so one, one day we were playing at BPS Club, you know BPS Club, Margao? So we were doing a sound check there, before the dance. It was a carnival dance. And I was doing a Portuguese song by Robert Carlos. We were doing a sound check. Suddenly two ladies come in and they ask, uh, Excuse me, were you all playing the recorded music or is that, uh, or you all were singing? So our band leader said, no, we were singing. Yeah, who, who's the singer? So they pointed out to me. And that lady is saying like, my God, my hair stood up. You're sounding just like him. You know, that, that made me feel good, you know, wow. You know, I'm good here, you know. So. You know, slowly, 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 and steadily, pride started coming. As you know, as a, a band life, a band, uh, I mean, a musician's life, in the past, at least not now, there's not so much, but in the past 90s and early 2000s, musicians were considered a big thing in Goa. So being the main singer of a topmost band, I used to climb speakers, I used to jump from here to there, what would I used to do? So I became famous very fast. But in this time, pride came. And I always had a dream of, you know, being someone very big. So I had composed around 10 songs in Hindi. And I had gone to Bombay, and I recorded the songs. And it was in Nadim Shravan's studio in Andheri. So as I was doing one particular song, it's a very slow love song. He passed, he heard the song. So he sent a message with the recording engineer, ask him if he's selling that song. I'll buy it. So that guy told me he's ready to pay 50,000. Sell it to him. So I thought in my mind, I'm spending more than two and a half lakhs for the whole project. 50,000 he's going to give me. 
and I lose my main song, like you know, because I knew that song had uh, it, it would stand somewhere. So I refused his offer, and I said I only will release the album. And to cut it short, I tried to do it on my own. I could not do it on my own because in Bollywood, you know, you need a lot of money. And those days, we had to have at least two videos in Channel V and MTV to promote your uh, album. And one video was costing nothing less than 10 lakhs. Starting, uh, depending who's your model, who's your director, and all blah, blah. So I didn't have that kind of money. So I got a little bit disappointed. But then someone told me, you know, uh, I can give you a contact who will give you how much money you want, he'll give you. But then what happened? You'll have to pay him back. Uh, so I, s I had a meeting with him. He was the middleman of a don. After that I came to that, he said, it means he would be the middleman. They were ready to finance right up 25, 30 lakhs, no problem. And I heard a lot of stories about Don. Then I know if you can't pay that, they'll come and shoot you. So I said, forget that. <laughs> naka, album naka. I came back to Goa. And as I came back to Goa, I was having a business, I was having a cyber cafe. And as time was going on, I thought, since the album didn't work out, I'll do a big show, you know, like, you know, the seafood festival? You heard of the seafood festival? Seafood festival used to be a four to five days festival in Miramar. Huge. It's uh, organized by the Goa Tourism. So I thought I'll also do something of that kind, you know. So I did a festival of three days in Porvorim. Big, huge ground. So in that time, one of my rival, band rival, I don't want to name him, he called the cops at exactly nine o'clock. So all my three days were spoiled. And the third day by rain. Two days were spoiled by cops coming and uh, stopping the show. And the third day was by rain. And you know, when you bring all those big bands and all the entertainment, sound, generator, you have to pay, no? Last minute, my sponsor also backed off. He had promised me around 300 cases of beer. He gave only 50. Because if I had the beer, I could sell it. And with that money, I could pay some people. Whiskey fellow backed off. And somebody had uh, uh, promised me uh, cash. That fellow also backed off. Now the thing, and just that time, Lavina had come in my life. And people started coming at my door, asking for money. Now from where to give the money? So I had to hide inside. They're coming outside, ting tong, ting tong, ting tong. I used to come, peep from the hole. Some people used to abuse from outside. Oh, we know you're inside. I used to see slowly tiptoe and go hide. So I did all these things. I was very depressed. I was getting, you know, frustrated. Now from where to get the money? Because what you want in the band is only for you and your family, not to pay. So I shared this problem with one of my friends. And he told me, Ari, you go to one place, huh? You just solve the problem, Ari. Solve it. I said, yeah, where are they? They're on the right side. There's one blue color house. There's one Baba there. He's very powerful. Mm. So I went to him. I went to him. He asked me, what's the problem? I told him, this financial problem, this problem, that problem. So he asked me, how's your family with you? I said, family with me, mom is good. My elder sister, I and we, her, we have a problem. We're not talking. Ah. He put one, we are sitting on the ground, huh, both of us. Baba is here, I am this side, and people are around. One candle is there, he's telling me, look in the candle. So I'm looking in the candle, in the flame, no? What happens now in your conscience already, you, your picture is of your sister, no? So I'm looking, looking, looking. One female shape, this long in the flame. So I told her, Baba, oh, you can't, uh, eh, buy this tamaka. Sangunaduka, to you buoyant. Ah. 
I said, okay, thanks, thanks. So I came home, I told Lavina, my elder sister, she's done the black magic, that's why I'm going losses here. Mm. So she's the problem. So I asked, then I went next time to Baba, I said, I think it's solution. Then he told me, we'll have to do this puja, that puja, this, 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 you'll have to pay so much. Delay. He told me, in, in 21 days, solve. 21 days, 22, 40, two months went, kind solution. I said, what is this now? I met my friend, I took it there, I said, where you sent me, man? That fellow is there telling me to look in the candle, the candle, what is going to solve my problem, what? Flop fellow is sent me. Then I met another friend. I told him, Oh, he's all in. Are you sold? Ponda, there's a solid, powerful fellow. Sold, boro. Think of it. In between, I met two, three other fellows also. I'm just cutting it short. So I went to this Ponda fellow. We both went. This time we both went. So I and Lavina went there. We entered. The room is like, like dark like this. Okay? And there's one guy sitting on the floor. There's one matka there in front. And I and Lavina went and sat opposite. <laughs> She's laughing. <laughs> Those days you were not laughing. But now when we recall it is funny. So he made us sit. So he asked us, Kisko problem hai? So I said, much go. Ah. Shirt nikalo. <laughs> I'm saying in my mind, in case she had a problem, take sang pass a shirt card. Oh, I get a shirt card. Anyway, I removed the shirt. Removed the shirt, they brought one jello, you know, the garland. As if I'm getting married, they put it around me. And he, he started asking me questions. We foolish, I told him all my problems. Huh? All I told him everything. I am doubting my sister. So all the Okay. Matki is here. I'm going to ask the Matki. If the Matki moves, no, that is the answer. Why? What am I? So he said, you name, name. Kone white, kiss ne usko black magic kia. So I'm naming her. Then I said my sister's name. Kadak, the pot moved. I looked at Lavina. Pahile? My sister. So what mal kriya? Okay. Then he asked more questions that, but uh, you know, the funny part, the thing moves, you know. The pot moves. Kadak, yeah. So thing is question question round kabar so solution mein my sister is a culprit okay so now now the solution so baba bhi kya karna hai puchega so he's asking you'll come out of him crack it moves ah aayega means the evil spirit that is in me he'll come out the pot said he'll come out ah what you'll take Kya lega? One goat? Two goats? That he kept on asking animals. I'm saying, what's wrong with this guy, man? Huh? Then he reached two elephant, a uh, hati, and my heart is taka, taka, taka. If, if this is hati, I'm going to of hati. At last he came to goda, horse. Goda lega. Kak! Gunle. I said, yeah. <laughs> then, okay, Goda, Gola, Mare. Kitana Goda. Are Babre. Suppose this is seven, I'm going to do. Pay attention. Goda, Ek Lega. Not movie. Do, Gole. And I'm looking at this guy. Inga na poise. I've come to you for money solution. And you are asking me to buy whether one horse or two horse. Tinga kaba zang na. Konsa color? Safed wala. Black. Lal. Kak.
So red color horse. So I'm just looking at him. Then I told Baba, "Mere pas paisa the na goda choda je. Goda ka upper wo dalta wo bhi ilane ke liye paisa nahi hai." हाँ ऐसा है मैं क्या करता हूँ मैं अरेंज करेगा घोड़ा ही से फोर्टी थाउजेंड अरेंजमेंट करो फोर्टी मुझे मैं नेक्स्ट मंथ बाड़े दी बात पूछ नहीं मगर तू हाँ की तो ले तुम ले नहीं है नहीं नहीं होगा नहीं देना पड़ेगा नहीं उधर आदवाई डेट इवल स्पिरिट विल डिस्ट्रॉय यू हमने जाए ना और कुछ देखो उपाय ठीक है देखते हैं और कुछ लेगा कुर्क आलो दो बरा जानी चले में एक काम करो टू किलो बादाम टू किलो पिस्ता नहीं साम साम थिंग्स आई एम सेइंग आम ही बादाम पिस्ता मैं आए नहीं ये कब बोले जाए बादाम पिस्ता ऐसे चलो सॉइ भी तो रख रहे हैं चल ओके ऐसे चल लाएगा मैं जानी सर ओके नाउ आई एम गोइंग टू प्रे एंड दैट इवल स्प so be careful. I said, okay. He gave me a glass of water. He told me to drink mm, goggle and spit in that mudki inside. So I spit inside. Hari, that pot no suddenly burst. Toes, hello. Hari, bago, bago, bago. Everyone is saying, oh, we are in Lavina. We don't know. We are running here. I am with the jello. Can you imagine without anything? I am with the. I am like a. Nanga Dula, I'm running and she's running. We both are running. And we sat in one corner. And and thanks to the boy assistant, Hanu, to ah Baba ke liye pray karo, Baba ke liye pray karo. And we are praying now. Ki Baba safe, ki Baba safe. Kona amun kona. I don't know what we are praying. Pahum. Suddenly to ah oh 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 oh. Think of sound effects inside. Oh, hari wo. Atma ne Baba ko attack kiya. In around 10 minutes, they made us sit there quietly. They rearranged the room. Anek mot ki aali. Okay, yaan to Baba baroha di nga. Putte hi liya mi. He liya ni bohli. So he told me, in before 48 hours, you have to bring that badam, pista, tiens okla, kilisht. Otherwise, I will have to release that spirit, and the spirit will attack you, and they will come more powerful. Maybe we can't help you. We both looked at one another. Akit kore ano? Need to sort out this problem, no? But in my mind, no, I was not very convinced with this whole thing. This fellow, kitla smart poy the? Ap idhar se jayega na? Four hundred meter, kuch baat mat karo. So we both, I put on my shirt, 400 meters, till the bike, kai ule nae me. Then after we crossed a little further, I asked, baby, what do you think about this whole thing? I don't know, she's saying, you think it'll happen? I'm like, brain, she's like, I'm not going to die. I'm not going to die. So, we were like, frustrated, like, you know. I just looked up to heaven and I said, if you really exist, no God, then you help me. Otherwise, I think my time is come. It's a lot of frustration along. So in that time, I was playing in the band, no? I just came home from a show. Sarko healthy, huh? Came home from the show. Morning I got up, my right feet swollen. Ani so called dono zaina itle dukta. So already was paining. I'm saying, just yesterday I came from the show, so I fit and fine. Podong na kaya na kaya na, swollen, painting solid. And I'm saying, what is this here? And today I have a show, again I have to go. I can't even put the shoe, man, how I'll go? So I phoned the band guy, I said, I, I said, we'll give the show to somebody. No, no, we'll come and pick you up, you come with chappal only, you sit and sing. I said, but how I'll come down, I can't walk. No, we'll carry you, don't worry, to you. Light only I went for the show with chappal. Light only I came back home. In our building, you know, there was a believer family right down. And they were my mommy's friends. So my mom told them, you know, my son yesterday came from the show. Uh, she said, you want, I'll 
I'll pray for him. I'll come and pray. So my mommy came and told me, you know, they want to pray. And who believer? Cha! I don't want anyone in my house. Believer will be if they even enter the house. Hey, I would damn against all this. My problem was not getting solved. My feet were not getting solved at all. At last, my mom said, Are, at least let them come and pray, no? What are you losing? Let them come pray and wash on the. I'm going to lock it off. So they came, they laid oil, they prayed. Next day, healed. Next day, my, this was totally healed. This was the first sign. Second sign. I and the, my guitarist used to stay in the north. So one day we decided to come by bike, not by car. So we were coming. As we were coming, Bambulim, exactly Bambulim Hospital, no? As we are crossing, one Kadamba bus is coming this side. And, and we are overtaking the bus. Suddenly from nowhere, other side of bus is coming. Now either the bus will bang me or I will come under the bus. There is no way out. I'm telling you, I just gave up. I must have left my hands also. I don't know how. I escaped. Nothing happened. And those days, the roads were not broad. Miguel, you'll know. The roads were not broad for three vehicles to pass. I don't know how. I just passed through. Second sign. Third sign. I was coming home one night at the Mandovi Bridge. I was driving the car, and I was very tired that night. I crossed the whole bridge sleeping. The whole bridge I crossed sleeping. Suddenly I got up and I said, Are I crossed the bridge. Third, third sign. So signs were just coming to me like, you know, that death, death is coming. So anyway, I, I didn't have a solution for my, any of my problems. So one day, as you know, my sister and I were not talking. I had come to Panjim to do some, I had some work in Panjim. And just near the police station, as I'm going, opposite direction, my sister is coming. The same sister who I'm, who I'm not talking to. She's looking at me, I'm looking at her. And I'm saying, man, hmm, yeah, like, you know. And she's looking and smiling. I'm saying, <laughs> so I looked at her eyes angrily, and I went ahead, and I looked behind. She also, she called me. So I said in my mind, Aizahare, today I'll give a solid, I'll tell her whatever I have in my mind. You did black, black magic for me. Uh, I will tell her. I know everything about you. So she stopped me and she said, uh, I want to introduce you to somebody. Just come with me. I said, well, we'll sit in a restaurant. I didn't trust her. So I said, you go front, I'll follow you. <laughs> so she went. We went to that uh, Sagar restaurant in near Don Bosco's. And we ordered tea, whatever. And she started telling me her testimony. She was having some problem with her divorced husband. And uh, she was going to suicide. She was going towards Kurtori, you know, the Borda Road. So as she passed BM Hall, she heard praise and worship. And that particular song, I pulled her in. She turned the bike, went inside, and she entered the church. And the church members welcomed her and all that. To cut it short, her life was saved. She gave her life to Jesus. And in this time, she started praying for me. Save my brother, save my brother. Now see how the devil puts in you. She is praying to save me, and the devil is putting in my mind that she is doing black magic for me. You see how the devil works? So, as she was sharing her testimony, I, I felt bad. But uh, still, I didn't believe her because I'm saying in my mind, I'm saying in my mind, I didn't say to her. So, in this time, she told me that we have been praying for you for the last six months for God to touch you. And she got in her vision that the spirit of death is after me. 
when she said that, no, it recollected me. First my feet, then my accident, two times I missed. Maybe, you know, something was supposed to happen and because of her prayers, you know, that it avoided. So I, I started little paying attention. My niece who was that time just eight years old, okay? So she said, can I pray for you, she said. I said in my mind, okay, pray, no problem. I'm telling you the prayer that she did, you know, I started crying. I started immediately crying. Because the, the words that she used, how they were like, you know, double-edged sword. They touched my heart, so this, and I just started crying. And I was really touched, and I said, I want to come to church. I, I want to see. So I said, I'll, I'll come. I'll come next Sunday. I went back home. I told Lavina, so and so thing happened. She also was a little bit shocked to hear. Certainly, out of black magic, now suddenly, So the next Sunday, we went to church. And then we gave our life to Jesus, and then, and then we were saved. But still, I was a stubborn brat. Okay, my sister said you can't worship idols. It's all a card. And I, you know, from Portugal, my mom had that big rosaries, the and all that. I said, she she I will keep that. I'm not worshiping, but I'll keep it. Kudasa. She said, no, remove it. I said, no, no, please, that you don't tell me. Huh? Anything he has to tell, that you don't tell me. So one day I was doing music, and I had the headphones on. Early morning, it was around 9 o'clock. And I heard a voice call me, you know, Ellen. Like, you know, I removed to see who, nobody's there. Three times it happened. The fourth time, take those idols and throw it out. I'm telling you, I got up southern position. Fast, it put it Kala 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 empty kala went Mandavi river. Boomba. Bye. In this time, God was processing me. And as I was being processed, we were baptized. We, I don't want to name the church and all that. So I used to observe the worship band there. You know, I should say in my mind, why we both are not given a chance there in the worship band, you know. So I told the pastor, not directly, not you. That pastor, I told you, you know, you can't tell directly, you know, I want to play in the worship. Uh, if you want any help, any assistance in the worship team, uh, we both can help, I said. And by that time, we had already released our gospel album. I, released, I could not release the Hindi album, but all glory to God, I, re I released the gospel album. Amen. So, that pastor said, no, there is time for you. And I'm saying, my what time? These guys, what they're playing there? I can play better than that. I thought in my mind. But no, he didn't give a chance. In, instead, he told uh, Lavina and me, she kept her in charge of toilet. She had to clean the toilet, BM hall. I'm telling you, stinky toilet. Oh, my Lord. She was you know, doing the toilet, and we are like sweeping. And I'm saying in my mind, Kai, we're a famous musician now. <laughs> huh? All they come. Yeah. So, anyway, God was building us up. The lesson what I've learned is no matter how talented and how good musician you are, you cannot come with your talent in front of God. It stinks unto him. Your pride, your talent stinks. You understand? He wants you to come as you are. Humble yourself, come to me. And this was my walk, and this is how I understood the, the power and the value of worship. That's why my worship team I thank you all for having patience with me. I, actually, I am a, yeah, I'm a very, uh, when it comes to music, I, I can't bear wrong chords, wrong beat. Oh my God. And when John, our John, I tell him, 
अरे माका पोए रे वेन टू स्टार्ट वेन टू फिनीश ऑलवेज टेल यू माका पोए सो कैन टेल यू वेन टू स्टॉप वेन टू स्टार्ट ही नेवर लुक्स यू लाइक कैन नॉट पोए आज पास आई एम ट्राइंग टू टेल हिम स्टॉप कॉस्ट ऑफ देन आई वेंट एंड म्यूटेड हिम देर ऑन द मिक्सर so basically what i'm trying to say is no matter how talented we are no matter who we are we may be a star we may be a superstar but in front of our god i'm a zero amen, amen. so i give all glory to god because if i'm here today is not because i'm worthy of it is because he he had mercy on me and he made me worthy amen, amen. He made me worthy that I can carry His cross and proclaim His word. Never in my wildest dreams did I ever think I would share, I will preach, I will worship. I never thought of that. I always thought of big, big crowds. You know, I thought I would be a superstar, and I would talk about myself. How many songs I compose, how, how I can sing, how many languages I can sing. But no. In in the presence of God, we are a nobody. Amen. Amen. So I'd like to give God all the glory. Amen. Thank you for having patience and listening to my story. Hallelujah thank you thank you Alan for this wonderful testimony shift to praise god uh i'm so glad to hear this wonderful testimony because in this testimony what comes up is that pride okay when i started growing in my business people used to come uh suppose if anybody who is coming with a dirty clothes or dirty feet i used to underestimate that person but then god showed me as i started giving my life to jesus i started god showed me that every man is same every man is same uh, whether he is a poor man or rich man whether it is a fair or black whether he is educated uneducated god taught me that we need to respect every customer what i have so that is where i was getting into my in my head that i was supposed to get into the pride okay and the bible says but he gives more grace he gives more grace what is this therefore, therefore it says god opposes the proud but gives grace to the humble so whatever talent you may have whatever talent you may have let not that pride enter into our life and god wants to bring confusion in our life so that he loves us he wants us to come closer to him god brought confusion in alan's life because he had a plan and today alan and lavina and his children are serving the living god Amen. serving the living god my dear friends i want to tell you we have not much time now so we'll ask uh, we have been we have built a small church in kurtorim hindi church those who like to visit us this uh, this evening please come at about 4 o'clock what time 4 o'clock we are we are today we are happy that we put a shade otherwise we were worshiping uh, under the tree and we used to run here one house to other house and uh, i'm going to, i'm excited that god used rocky to make that shade and uh, rocky please come and share don utrani tuka dewan kitkon aadar dilo ti shade bandpa Good morning, church, and good morning, everybody. Our company no mungile thakti shi testimony dum di ta. Jarna pastor ma ka request kele no kurtori church build korpa. They open pray ko thale hoy open ahle thinji rena ahle shade na le renga. So pastor mur par rokhi ek kam korpa thay. Ami pastor ki thale ek korpa thay. And we had a meeting. Uh, a uh, few days before like i think it is on monday alan meeting he, on monday gitle no tuesday tuesday meeting gitle ani pastor murpalalo ek shed ban pade rocky tu ko jato le mane ya pastor au ko ta so pastor mule au get design dida kit ko korpa eta to pastor pavilion murpal man cup kalo nam te bond korpa dai so i ek design kelo ani pastor dakilo pastor and त्यांचे हिंदीचे चाल त्या काही सांगले ही भाषा बांधपास होत आहे म्हणून 
So I am Pastor Malaya. Atanti shed bandai, no plastic bandai. Me, amal will use a bamboos and the pillar itu, no. Tiada kat le, ane kami ayi start kelik kam. So think ini hal le te churchit pui members aha, no. So kalau kam kuta te churchik. Te sokan cik kamo itu, nust wing pau itu, atau tuade nust katur pau itu. So, ani sokan cik temar awak lupa lo. So mak kisah le, makai ke helper saya asal le. So tension dua jam berdiri le, ane kiri bail. Te am cie, nama kita je, betul tak? Manju, Manju, Manju multi bail lain makmur palal rock. Tum bina ke brother? Apa nak hatu jupara bo? And she took me to the jungle. It will push jungle to bring up bamboos, like bamboo to cut corner, but I don't know. So, I am below me, I think, how many times I can do it? Snakes, how many times I can do it? Tiger, how many times I can do it? So, I am going to go. So, I am going to go. God is there with me. Get out. And she went in front of me. So, I am going to go. So, I am going to go. And I am going to go. 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 But, how many times I can do it? So, I am going to go. We reached that point. अनि आये थे बंबू कट के ले, या, सो माके छोड़ जाले बंबू, कोई लाम मर्डर ले बंबू, मुझे पास्टर ने ऑर्डर कोई बंबू जाले ले, सो ते उन्हें पढ़ पला, ये बार आये नीट पंद्रह बंबू जाले मगा, अनि कौन है ना दोग जहाँ थे लान बुर्गे, सो आये मुझसे लाऊं कतुता, सो देवान मगा बोर दिले थे कतुर पाक, अन्य आता पॉइंट आता हूँ बंद पसो मुनिस ना सो ये दोगो ही बुर्गियाँ क्यों ना इतने बाइल दिन हेल्प कर मगा मॉर्निंग टाइम अन्य सांची थे किट को तले ऐताले सोगले ऐताले अन्य को गाइड को तले मगा कोरिया सो लेंग कोरिया तेंग कोरिया तेंग कोरिया सो पांच दिस लगले मगा इस शेड बंद पाक इस शेड पे बंद Jadi, saya break gil lo, mungkin shakal ni bicar. Tapi, nama soalnya kam kota le, bandow apa, uro sab soalnya. Ani, it like 15 to 16 years zalei, ti bonah le. Pun suddenly makai kumeh do sheili, ani mulai cel, aku complete kota lo. An zatte bahsi naya no, ur gelo. Band pas start kelle, ani, supaya pelas sulu mesir koshman le. Ani Yen zatu guz maya yang kita cintle, atmule plastik galdo guz, flora cir, flora cir ada atam preach kutanu, ayen cintle ke stage bandia, pastor hawara dale nak pastor foto dale tu kaito, ek ek footage over stage bandli, an tinga ek amso tense kam dera, to amur pala amur play muda, brother, am bandia, amul sol bandia. कित जाते मर जाते कितने पासर टाइम नहीं आने तक उधो फ्लो जाता स्लो पाहा डिवोटेन सो आये थे राती टिल टेन ओक्लॉक दिन को रावण मैं ना मैं डेली मुंडो लेट आया था ले आम मारियन मक हेल्प के लिए सो गलो बराबर सपोर्ट के लो थैंक्स ना टेन जंगल है ना सो बाकी सो गले टेन सपोर्ट टेके लो मखा मुझे बराबर ऐसा लो आज सुनना लो कि रात मक्स बाय संडे ते रेडी हैंड ओवर कर पड़ा ले फॉर अ नेक्स्ट चेंज दिस वाज अ लास्ट नाइट पिक्चर ये आकिट्स फैमिली दें जी प्रे ऐसा थी सो दे आर सो हैप्पी दें चंच चिंतु देखो ना नहीं फाड़ लें तुम ते वाइट डिस्ट है ना पहला डेट्स अ प्लाई एंड बिलो डेट डेज अ स्टेज अने जिन जेजुन मगरनो कुर्पा दिली एक कुर्पा सो त्याग के ले अनेक ब्रेस्टरक ब्रेस्टराओं काम को तल वो रहा लो असल वार ही लो ज़ूम 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 को वार मालो वार माल मुन्टो आये मुन्ले आरे मुन्ले आत मुन्ले काम जावा ना मुन्ले एंड टू थर्टी थ्री एक ओल्ड किस जाले तीन जाले है सो वार ही लाने मैं वार � साइड इन देखते शे यहाँ कितने मुड़े बालवाड़ी टाइप बालवाड़ी ना हाँ अच्छा बालवाड़ी सो आम सोल के लिए तो साइड ऊपर वाले वारियत मुना नहीं इतने फास्ट सर को तूफान जाए ना तो इस साल ले अरे एक ऊपर आस्तुना खटक 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 करने वाला आवाज़ यो पालगलो 
इतर मोटा आई थिंक सोलें सोलें मुल तुम या हाँ ना हंगा पिलर आसान ना आनी तेरे पार्टी आसान थी तीन आरा वाह आनी होना उसना का बाइलेन वार हाँ ना सो खड़ा कुन कितर पढ़ ले अरे मने हुई तोर ज़्यादा पढ़ लास्त ले स्विल जलर आमी वो भी आ लेते बालवाड़ी साइडी चन बालवाड़ी साइडी चन एक ओल्डी ज़्यादा वोर सम मोड़न सकला पढ़ ला ना मुन्टे बालवाड़ी ची पढ़ो ना अम्चेरी पढ़ो ना ते टेंट बंदल तिंगाई पढ़ो ना सो दैट इज़ द टेस्टमनी आउं दिपस होता थी जेजु नो सोगले टाइम आर मगा सपोर्ट दिला फॉर दिस फाइव डेज आई थिंक काम केला काइंस मग प्रॉब्लम जाओ ना इवन दे टू केयर ऑफ़ आवर हुड आल्सो मुझे हमका जोड़ना चाहिए दैन पर जोड़न बत्ती ये कर पला ले एंड फाइनली मुझे एक एम आलो आउं ते कंप्लीट कोतल टेडिसा � God bless you all. Thank you, uh, Rocky, for this wonderful testimony. All glory goes to Sogli Moima Kona Goida, Jesu Goida, Hallelujah.